Reanimate your feet. No. No? I don't want to dance for the rest of my life. There you go. So there we go. We went, we listened to the Reanimator song. Yeah, and we'll link it on this one, too. Yeah. So that was not the movie you saw? No. No. That, that, that makes sense. I recognized one of the characters. I feel but, like the doctor guy is supposed to be the same doctor. But you could obviously tell he was older in that one. Sure. So. Okay, now, as promised... You, you're going to kill that girl, but first you got to get a whole lot of Rosie. Well. That's how it's done. Oh, man, and that thing... Where'd she go? Where'd she go? You can't... Oh, jeez. Oh, wait, wait. Gotcha. <laughs> She's like, no. Stop it. Maybe that'll work one of these days. No. Mmm, slug. There we go. And I got $61. And I got a first aid kit. Those are all the things I got, everyone. Those are all the things you got. You killed a girl, you got points. Get points for killing girls. Yeah. Don't you? I don't know. I haven't done it in a while. Yeah? Yeah. That's the joke, like he said, in a while. Like you've done it before. Yeah, right. That was the joke. Okay. Yeah, sure. Oh, I can't have any more liquid nitrogen. You can't have any more liquid nitrogen, you motherfucker. I got another first aid kit. But you gotta get, you gotta get water. Yeah, I know. There's an arrow. Says, that's to that's, Arcadia. That goes. There's two different ways to go over there. Wasn't well, that suspicious? You're suspicious. Is there another camera? I the bench warmers did not have a music video associated with it. Is that would it have gotten a full three stars if it did? If it was a music video like that, then yeah, maybe. Completed. Seven chlorophyll. Even though I didn't. More make, like oh, chlorophyll. Found one of seven. Thank God I don't need any more of that. Oh, oh it's Pierre Gobel! <laughs> Jacques Cousteau! Try the key! Dude! Oh, there you are. There you are. Did you see it? I saw I it. I saw it. No, oh, we've already heard this one. Uh, Have we? Yeah, Blueprints of Sin. Oh. Uh, when I was working at that one car company, there was a French guy... Subaru. Worked... Sure. <laughs> Get yourself a Nubaru Subaru. Because uh, Andy got one. Andy got a Subaru, everybody. We already said that, though. You, you know, and, like, uh, he said that on Facebook, and, like, it's the kind of thing where... And everyone just said, faggot. There was, yeah, he's the kind of, he, like, his his friends and family are the kind of people who have car opinions, and I don't know car opinions, so I don't... They're the kind of people who would earnestly be like, oh, found on roadside dead, am I right? And it's like, oh, cool, I haven't heard that one before. You need to duly dupe in your dupe dot. I understand that. Uh, but yeah, they had things to say about Subarus, and then he was like, whatever, which is the appropriate response. Uh, and then, like, someone showed a picture of a fucking, like, Subaru in the desert or something, and he was like, well, I have a different Subaru, and I was like, well, what do you say to that? Nothing. What was I fucking saying? Why did I get on this? Why were we talking about Subarus? <laughs> when you worked at that car I, company. When I worked at that car company... For a while, I worked with a, a French guy. Uh, let's call him Chris. Jacques Cousteau. Jacques Cousteau. Let's call him Chris. And Chris, Jacques better. Chris was uh, was nice because he was really like straight laced and proper, and just like, oh, well, I don't know what you're talking about, you know. But then every once in a while, he would cut loose. He'd be like, someone walk away, and he'd be like, I I could not believe, like, you know, how annoying she was <laughs> or whatever. I'm like, Jesus Christ, Chris. What the fuck was that all about? Well, he couldn't believe. He couldn't believe it. He's just like, real talk. He's not going to fuck around. Yeah. And we went to fucking Utah together. Uh, oh, did you elope? Uh, there was robots involved. 
I was the I was a robots guy. I had to go look at some. Ro- I had to go help out with some robots. We did some robots. Dude, why doesn't anybody have machine gun rounds anymore? Because you upgraded the machine gun on that first upgrade. I know, but there was one that had them. There was one. That well, this is their way of encouraging you to use all the weapons. Fuck them. Because in games when like ammo is plentiful, you just pick the fucking RCP ninety and don't use anything else. Fine. But you know real what? talk, the RPC-90 is pretty good. The you RCP-90. Want, you want me to use another weapon? Yeah. Here. What are the other two things on there? No, like I'm going to burn them to death. What's actually, the other one? Actually, I should use uh, uh, liquid nitrogen. because What's can't the third it. one? It's electric, electric gel. gel. No, it's electric up. gel. The third one's electric gel, everyone. Yeah. Everybody gets it because what's the third one? What's the third hey, one, though? What's, what's the, the third one? What's the third one? one? What's the th- well, we always see two. I don't know what the third one is if we only see two. <laughs> now you guys get to interpret if I was actually mad at him or not. Leave it a like, comment, subscribe. What the fuck? <laughs> There's a camera over there. You triggered him. Yeah, hide in here. Tell, just tell him to fuck off. I will. I will. I'm gonna listen oh, to Desperate Times too. Appropriate. Look at all this cheese. Looks moldy. Well, I mean, I got a lot of cheese and wine in here if I just want to stay in here for a few years. Mmm. <sighs> what? This is an important tape, I think. Well. Well, Where was I feel the... like that might be a spoiler, honestly. I feel like I've put too much together. Yeah? Yeah. Well, that's what the tapes are supposed to be for. Yeah, but m- most of the tapes are just a bunch of... Sh- it's just like, oh no, we're in an underwater city. Or, oh, I was in a camp, you know. But that's like, this is probably what's going to happen in the plot in another couple hours. And it's like, oh, thanks, tape. You're welcome. But you know what? Well, here's the thing. I feel like at this point, like this game must be spoilered because if that if that really happens, then that must be like a twist. That must be a twist that happens. What if it doesn't happen? I don't think it's obvious enough for a non-twist to be the twist because sometimes <laughs> the twist is that there's no twist. Well, like uh, it, I don't. I honestly felt like in the. M. Night Shyamalan movie Signs, I felt like, oh my. I honestly feel like the twist in Signs is that there were actually aliens. I feel like the entire movie, I was waiting for there to not be aliens because it was like a Shyamalan movie. Yeah. And then there were aliens, and I'm like, oh, is that the thing? Is that I was supposed to think there were not aliens for the whole movie? But maybe it was just a, a mediocre movie about aliens. Uh, I think it's that option. Oh. I just drank Or, like, is the twist, so, so sign spoilers, because whatever. Uh, there's, like, a whole... Th- search containers for loot, by the way. Uh, first encounter. Oh, encounters of the first kind. Oh. We get it. <laughs> Her pallor was off, green and morbid. I'd rather listen to a woman talk than him. It was just so endearing. <gasps> Hatred? Sure, I'll take a picture of a guy taking a shit. <laughs> this poor dude. He was just chilling. Is it because he's wearing a hat that he's easier to sympathize with? Yeah. 
Although he's not a gentleman because he's wearing a hat indoors. Well, he tipped his hat to you, but he hasn't got a hat. Well, what was I talking about since before I we got interrupted? What were we? I don't know. Probably, what was happening? Probably penises or something. Yeah, penises. Oh, man, I got lucky. I didn't even... Why was I using anti-personnel rounds? Why were you letting me do that? Oh, jeez. Oh, my. What, did you think I was going to fight this guy? Uh, well, you're just shooting right next to him, and then she shot fireballs, and she missed him, too. And he's just fucking chilling. He's just walking through the whole area like... Oh, he doesn't care as long as you don't attack him. Well, I was, but can't, if enemies attack him, will he get upset at them? Yes. See, so I was wondering... I was waiting for that to happen, too. So he's just wandering through this fucking magic fireball fight, going like, well, I got shit to do. I can't really be fucking dealing with this right now. Just think whizzing past his head, and he's like, long as you don't touch me, uh, we ain't got no problems, right? Well, yeah. Yeah. Isn't that how you'd be? Uh, get more Eve with every first aid kit by using new Eve Link 2. Nope. Walk quietly and carry a big drill arm. That's what Teddy Roosevelt used to say. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I gotta say, you know, really, before I do all this, I probably should just be checking and seeing if it has what I want. Man, fuck you, game. Man, just fuck you, side... Oh, yeah, that's you, it. Yeah, that's it. Well, don't they add Look, more... They don't have it. Oh, you, they show you what's gonna get. get okay, alright, okay. Are you okay with that? I'm alright with it. I get it. Where am I? I'm over here now, and I wasn't... Oh, there's still somewhere ahead. Yeah, head. there's a little dark gray little patch in there. His head's glowing. It's because he's got, he like controls the turret. Press B to use first aid. It's just letting you know. Is that alright with you? No, it's Do not. Do you have to be critical of every fucking thing? If they're, yeah, if they, here's the thing. How many hours into the game are we? 5, I know 000. the, I know the first aid button. Don't tell me the first aid button anymore. You know how many times you tell me the first aid button? Maximum twice. And then you shut up. And you get, you get off my back. It was the same thing as when it said fucking, like, search for loot. Like, oh, really? Do I search for loot in this game? That's crazy. I hadn't been doing it the whole game. I'm going to need you to quit your bitching. Nah, it's never going to happen. What is happening back here? People are blowing up. Good thing I hacked that turret. <laughs> okay. This is where I was trying to go. I go straight ahead. Oh, it's... Oh, I can see. hack that, though, I think. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Oh. Auto. Now I'm out of them. Got some electric gel. Oh, that's a third one. Some kerosene. Some armor-piercing rounds. Some napalm. Why not? We'll smoke a cigarette. See the smoke coming off me? Because I was smoking. Oh, what a bad boy. That's it. That's all that was in You here. got a bunch of shit. Oh, you got some things up there. There First you go. Kit. All right. There you go, everybody. You found that out. Found found out that. that. <laughs> I'm tempted to set him on fire. Is that him? Is he just walk around going... <laughs> He's nowhere near that high-pitched. It's a groan, like a lower groany noise. Yes, that's him. You solved it. What are the Big Daddies? Do we know what the Big Daddies are? What's the deal? Are they just people who like... Maybe these guys will tell you. Thank you. I mean, I try to pull it when nobody's looking. <laughs> that felt a little dirty. Man. That thing to the left is a dead end. Yeah, I know. If you can get in. <gasps> oh, bees! bees! Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, bees. Oh, bees. What do I do with them? I don't know. They're do bees. I, do I just take it? 
Well, next time. No, I can't. Oh, the bees are still after you? Yes. Oh, there's oh, a beehive. Don't, don't. What have you done? What have you done? What have you done? <sighs> next time, <laughs> we're going to buy some plasmids and deal with these bees. Yeah.